Tiffany Show. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Tiffany. If you're time fan member, what's up? Y'all be back in that thing. And by the time that video and that thumbnail, you see your girl has a cook with me seafood bowl today. So, y'all ask for these cooking videos. I'm going to give them to y'all. Period. I've been, I've been craving for a good seafood bowl, y'all, in a minute. And I basically really just start making it on my own. I normally go to the, we have a crab shack here, an angry crab. We have a crab shack, I believe. And we have a um one closer to my house. But y'all, they tax and they want like $150 to $200 just to feed my whole family, which isn't bad with a bunch of us what we eat. Depends what they want in their, uh, their boils. But I want to save some money and do it at home. So that's what I'm gonna show you guys. I know you guys probably make y'all seafood boils a little different. But this is how I do mine, okay? Don't do too much. This is how I do mine. If you haven't already, make sure you guys comment, like, and subscribe. Turn on post notifications on so you never miss when your girl drops a video. As well, go ahead and tune to my personal channel, Quinny Savon, so you guys can get the day-to-day -day of my life if you want to know more about me. Go ahead and run that up. But we're here for the Steve Bowl, right? So I'm going to show you guys what I put in mine. And my family loves it. Um, I don't like mine too spicy. I don't like mine doing too much. So I'm just going to show you guys what I put in mine. So we do do the snow crab legs. It's just me and my husband here. And I've been craving it. And I'm like, well, you want a seafood boy? He's like, of course. So this is just for us. The kids don't know we eating this. And I'm pretty sure when they see this video, they're going to be really mad. Because they love when I make my seafood. So we're going to do some crab legs. One of these. Normally I get like three when I make it for my family. But with just me and my husband, I only got one box. These were $19. They were on rollback for like $17 a piece, but these were $19. And then I got some raw shrimp medium. Um, I love this. I actually like how they cook down and everything. I uh, normally do the cooked shrimp too. You use cooked shrimp, you do regular raw shrimp. It really doesn't matter, but we've been liking this. So I'm going to clean this off and everything. It's filled with my uh, crab. And then I'm going to put some corn in ours, just to, you know, the regular corn. I'm going to use that. And then I saw somebody on TikTok use broccoli, so I'm going to put broccoli in mine. And I'm going to do a smoked sausage. I don't have potato, but I am going to put some eggs in mine. So that's basically what I'm going to use in our boil. And then the seasonings I have is Slap Your Mama. Um, I got some lemon pepper. I'll put some adobo in there. I'm going to put some natural seasonings. And then I'm going to do the Obey seasoning as well. These are the seasonings I use. And it comes out super, super, super good. And I forgot this is my seasoning cabinet. Y'all, I have y'all right here by my seasoning cabinet. And then I'm going to put the Zataran shrimp and crab oil. I'm going to just pour a cap full in there, y'all, and it does justice. I did forget a lemon, so we're going to forget that. But that's everything that we put in our seafood bowl. So I'm going to go ahead and get us a pot and get um, our pot ready. And I'm going to go ahead and throw our crap, not crap. I'm going to go ahead and throw our, um, do our corn and I'm going to throw our broccoli in there. And then once I get the shrimp, Cook that. Well, y'all see everything. Let's okay. go. Let's make so, like I was saying before, y'all, I went ahead and put my eggs on. I have about five eggs in there. Um, in this pot, we have, um, we're going to put our crab in here eventually, but we're going to go ahead and put our uh, corn in there, and then I'm going to go ahead and peel the shrimp and clean those off, and then, well, no, my bad. <laughs> the shrimp and the uh, sausage is going to cook together in this pan, which is this one right here. And then we're going to start off and put our corn and our broccoli in there. So, but first to get the water going, we're going to put it on about a seven. I'm going to go ahead and start and pop, uh, pour a cup full of this in there. So just a cup full, not too much. Okay. So I do that. That's going, that's going, that's going. And then I'm gonna go ahead and open my corn. And like I said, this is for me and hubby. So I'm just gonna put us two corns a piece in there. And just pop it in our pot. And here's the other two. Okay. I'll just make an extra one because my older son gets out of school and he's like, why y'all make me none? Y'all, he always think that. And then I'm going to go ahead and put in my broccoli. I'm going to put my broccoli in here too because it's my first time making it, but whatever. We're just going to pop it in there. I just got a regular bread of broccoli for that. And then now I'm going to cook and clean off my shrimp. So that's what we're going to do. Okay. So right now I'm going to cook and clean off our shrimp. 
I know I'm like getting cut off with my angle. So I put the shrimp in a bowl. So this is how it looks in my bowl. I just make sure that you're gonna eat whatever you don't clean out of there. See that one? I wanna get all that out. We just gonna get it out of there. This is a bad bag. Ooh. Y'all standing up on the sink, cleaning the shrimp out like this. It's a lot. And it's a whole bag. When I normally cook it for everybody, I'm over the sink a minute. But normally the shrimp I get, it has, you really gotta peel it. This one's already peeled, really. You're just checking it. Make sure it's clean. Okay. Okay. So that's our clean shrimp are going to chop up our sausage. I'm trying to see, I'll probably just chop up one since it's just us. I really don't care for the sausage in the seat. Once again, this is how I make my seafood boils. You probably add a little bit more stuff. I just like my real plain and to the point. And then this sausage you're gonna put in here, like that. I don't eat the butt ends of it. Like I said, this is how I make man. Y'all know how, you know, y'all cook y'all stuff a certain way. This is how I cook man, and it's bomb. Okay, I'm gonna just throw, even though I'm gonna make my seasoning anyways, I'm gonna throw some of the slap your mama in there. Um, I put the all natural and we're gonna do some obey. All right. And then we're gonna use the same skillet to make our sauce. So we're gonna let that go ahead and cook down. And then after that, we're gonna remove it off the heat and add it to our other stuff. Okay, this is a good time. Now you can add your crab. It comes with that, ba the box I showed you guys earlier, it comes with five of them, so you can go ahead and dip those in there. And you pretty much wanna cook this down for about 10 or 15 minutes is what I do. Um, I just wanna make everything, I normally should have a lemon in here, y'all, I know. And let that come to a boil. And then I just remove it and then I'll put my seasonings on it, my seasoning at the end on it, but that's how our shrimp and sausage is looking. There's our eggs, we're gonna pull those off in a minute, and then this is how everything's looking in. This is my first time with broccoli in it, so I'll definitely have to let y'all know how that turns out, but you're pretty much just steaming everything. You don't wanna overcook it because I think it takes about 10, 15 minutes, crab does, but that's your liking. It's up to how you want it. So, and then for my sauces, I'm gonna put every all the seasons that I showed you guys back in this pan, and then um, with some butter. That's it. And then I'm gonna put it in one of those big pans and pour it over. And that's gonna be my seafood boil. 
but everything's just cooking down. So when I get everything, when I start the sauce, I will come back. I just use regular, the country crop, country crop butter. I normally get the sticks of butter, but I didn't have time for that today. So I just use what we have pretty much. So I just let this melt down. I'm using the same skillet that I made the sausage and um, the sausage and what did I put in there? Sausage and shrimp in. I'm gonna start with some obey. I just put some slap your money, slap, slap your mama, slap your mama in there. And I'm gonna try to throw this some in there, the obey. And then I'm gonna do the all natural seasoning. Y'all, normally I would have a lemon for this, but I do not. And then I'm gonna throw some lemon pepper in there. You can make your sauce as spicy, how mild you want it. It's pretty much up to your liking. I know this would have been so bomb if I had a lemon. So we're just gonna let that cook down and that's gonna be our sauce. And y'all, that's it. I don't follow everybody else's recipes, but that's our shrimp. Our shrimp turned out good. It's a little spicy, but it'll make do. Our sauce is boiling. What we like, then we're gonna transfer everything. So I will show y'all that. Thing before I put the sauce on there that I have, but the crab's in there, the corn's in there, the egg's in there, and the broccoli's in there, and the sausage is in there. So that's everything right now, and I'm gonna go ahead and pour the sauce on. This is my first time having it with broccoli, like I said, y'all, so. All right, and here's our sauce. You just wanna make sure you don't burn it. But here it is. Put it over everything. Ooh. Okay, y'all. All right. That's our seafood boil. Mm. It's good too. Put everything on it. That's how I like it. It's got a little kick to it. I probably did too much with the season, but other than that, it's gonna turn out really good. If you haven't already, make sure you guys comment, like, and subscribe, and your girl will see you in the next video.